Just think about this. Uh, we welcome back uh, Mark Thiessen and Harold Ford Jr. to the panel. Uh, we talked a lot about debates and when some candidates did debates and some didn't do them. Had the October 25th debate been September 30th, would this race have changed? Mm. Mark? I, I think it might have or maybe it wouldn't have. I mean, I think there's a broader issue here, which mm -hmm. is that, so think about this. We have the worst inflation in four decades, the worst collapse in real wages in 40 years, the worst crime wave since the 1990s, the worst border crisis in U.S. history. We have Joe Biden, who is the least popular president since Harry Truman, since presidential polling happened, and there wasn't a red wave. That is a searing indictment of the Republican Party. That is a searing indictment of the message that we have been sending to the voters. They looked at all of that and said, and looked at the Republican alternative and said, no thanks. That is, that is a, the Republican Party needs to do a really deep introspection look in the mirror right now because this is, this is an absolute disaster for the Republican Party and we need to turn back. We need to start, we need to look at who won today. Ron DeSantis, DeWine, uh, the, these, these governors, Kemp. Kemp. Abbott. Abbott, you know, look at these governors. This is the path mm -hmm. to the future. At electing these, 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 uh, you know, these, these radical candidates who, who ran far behind them has put the Republican Party in a terrible position, and voters have left an indi have, have indicted the Republican Party. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.